I have one myself, Rosie and Gav, and then we've got Al Marvel and Ethan over here. Line two, when they get here, we've got Humphrey and Al's Ammo, it's forwards, and then we'll get Ersky and Ethan with these. Line three, we've got uh, Mav, and then Archer and Theo, and Haggy's going to mix in with them, with JJ and Jack on uh, whenever Jack gets here. PKs, we've got forwards, we've got Tidy. And Mav with Al Marlow and Ersty, PK2, Al Archer, Cooper, Haywood, and then PPs is line one and two, boys. Everyone said they're gonna go down their own fucking ice. Let's be going hard. Full fucking 60. We didn't give up last week, but we did switch off and let them back in the game. So let's be fucking going. Get yeah, right in the game. We'll fucking take it to me from the start. It's our fucking win tonight, lads. They fucking <coughs> stole that off us last week. We need to back Evan up as well. We can't be doing what we did with him last week. We need to fucking be in front of him. We need to be strong in front of him. And we need to. He thought it was all his fault last week, and it fucking was. It was our fault for not fucking protecting the fucking house. We protect Evan at all costs, and we fucking do ne not let fucking Wallace shoot. Do not let him shoot, because it's fucking four goals last week, man. Four goals. And we need to cut the shit, stupid shit to fucking penalties out as well. Yeah. No one should have to face the time out anymore. It's going to fall week. No one should be giving time out today. But when you force it in there, it's so probably going to happen. If they've got an easy breakout, that would equally add pressure on for on small line. Let's just do the simple things right tonight. Get those pretty chippy goals and we'll do the way we're doing. We've got to do the basics right. So any chance you get, you get over that line, shoot. Get a shot off, we'll get someone driving the net. All three lines, I want one of you driving the net. Okay, another guy high in support. Okay, that's what we need to do. It does work. You'll get nice little tappings on that back post for the rebound. Right, don't be frightened of going to that pain. Okay, that's where you get most of your goals from. <coughs> Back on the top, so you just snipes it from the top of the circle. Don't keep them I've seen a couple on that one. Yeah, no bollies today, boys. These, these work in yeah. In our own, that China that. specials. Yeah. China specials are going to do the job for us today. So, Kane's already told you we're going sort of ultra box of one in our end. We are not going to give them the middle of the ice. Okay? We are going to protect the front of the net. As you've noticed, no backup today. So we work like fuck to protect him. Yeah? Any, any loose pucks in front, I don't give a shit if you ice it. We just reset and win the face off and get an exit. All right? That's the way that we've got to be in a road game. If it's going, it's got to go. It's got to go, yeah. It's got to be, it's got to be up here somewhere. So even if they stop it on the blue, we've got time to reset. Yeah. It cannot be on the ice. Yeah, if we see if we see that you forwards, there's plenty of speed out there. If you can beat the ice in, we'll get a chance on goal. Right. But seriously, look after the middle of the ice. As soon as we turn them over, wingers, you've got to spot which end, which side the puck's going to be coming out on and fucking get there. Alright? It's your job from that point. When the puck comes above those hash marks on the wall, you've got to battle like fuck to get it out. Alright? That's your job in the D zone. Okay? You chip it out. You give them nothing. Right? If we give them nothing, they'll get nothing out of the game and we'll turn them over. Right? But it takes three lines doing all the same job every shift. 20 minutes first period, 20 minutes second period, and finish off with full 60 by doing it for 20 minutes in the third. 
when you put that performance together, you'll turn things like this over. All right, we've got a good squad here. All right, we're already playing above, way above where we was last season. All right, so let's keep it going, keep the motivation going, keep at each other positively. All right, that's just going to bring up standards game on game. All right, so I believe in you. Yep, we'll leave you to the room. This one, boys, come on. Come on, boys. Come on, boys. Come on, boys. Come on, boys. Hey. Are you fucking ready, lads? Let's get some fucking noise in there, lads. Start it up. On left wing. Up here, on the weight loss, it's a stone down. We're here, bloody alert. Our captain, Chris Morgan. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well done, Hoggy. In centre, I've been in bed with Flo all week. No excuses like so lads, I ain't got a fucking shoulder. You got me? Whoa. 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 Whoa.
Yeah, we have a hunger one on the blue one quite a lot. Yeah, Simple ones as well, barging out, not through the middle, two or three times. Fuck your old pals, fucking ever, bro. Fuck out, man. Get the boys, eh? Everyone fucking catches, isn't it, there, lads? Yeah, it's not bad, we're fucking nil-nil. Fuck me, lads. We blew my fucking self, we need to fucking look out and fucking get going here. Because they're not going to fucking give us. I think we spent 70% in the D zone, man. Like, yeah. We need to be yeah, fucking yeah. just tighter. The problem is that's box plus one. That's what that, yeah. that's what that gives them. fucking effort, boys. You look around the room, everyone's putting a shift in. Let's keep fucking working. Play with some accountability. Everything you do will be accountable for it, eh? So it's fucking, I think it's strong theory, boys. What's up, boys? Don't bring guys, you know you're in a game there, don't you? Fucking okay, hell, that went like laying on a sunbed, that was. Yeah? yeah? So now you know you're in it, I'd start fucking matching their intensity, alright? There was good looks there. When we moved the puck like we intended to, we opened them up two or three times, okay? Right? They play three guys really deep. On, a, on another game, right, we put a couple of goals on there, way against the play. They're carrying the play. 20 fucking shots, Evan. 20 shots in a period of battle. Fucking bastard. You know what I did like? In front of him, there's guys putting the fucking bodies on the line trying to block it. Right? That's where it starts. That effort, okay, that's where it starts. You build on that. We just need to start thinking about moving the puck a bit more quicker with a bit more purpose. Alright? We are slow. They are back checking like fuck. Right? So if you're a centre and you've got a puck in the middle of the ice, someone is coming for you. Alright? Just move the puck. We've got our wingers nice out and wide. Let's use them and drive through the middle. And be like we said.
Okay, do you want it? Do you want it? I'm like, yeah. So this fucking skating away. Yeah. I won't, I won't have in that, mate. I couldn't, I couldn't, sleep. I couldn't, I couldn't sleep that. Fucking oh, boys. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. 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 I'm Sticking together like that, and in that period, I'd say, yes, they have a lot of chances. I think we have the two best ones. Yeah? So it proves that if you dig in, you're prepared to put the body online to prevent them from scoring, the chances are going to come from us. <coughs> we have got guys who can put the puck in the net. All right? So there's no reason to change the way that we're playing. You guys are out there battling like fuck for each other. That makes me really proud. All right? Let's stick together. And let's finish this off, right? We've got ourselves in a good position now, all right? We've been here before and the game's been done. First period, all right? We're here now into the second period. Now we've got our chance to go and take it, all right? It's because of an upset here, all right? Let's stick together, boys, and fucking hell, we'll get something from this game. Come on. <laughs> Well played, Evan. We were well deserved, mate. Great game. Hey, what a fucking game for us, lads. I know we scored and fucking show it, but that was a real good fucking shift from everyone, Matt. Keep it real brief, boys, but fucking hell, what a battle you guys did then. Good job, boys. Yeah? Sorry, I was shit so, tonight. Got away, <laughs> it got away from us a little bit at the end, but I don't think we deserved that. All right, we deserved the one goal game there. Or yeah. something yeah. else. We're just going, we went for it anyway, Yeah? We're tired a bit, so we'll just work on that. Yeah? I was really pleased with that performance. Probably the best performance when I've been on the bench 
even though we've not come out with any points for it. All right, so. Everyone, 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 but the jerseys, can we all put in here, please? Here, but put them in nicely, Any so brothers don't floor. fucking boot off. Okay, we joined after that game by number 20, Kane Taylor. Kane, <laughs> difficult game that, although the guys fought really, really hard, I think. Yeah, like, obviously, losing's never fun, but the boys that come today, we all dipped in. We all played for 60 minutes. I mean, at the end of the day, the first two periods were no no. Like, I mean, I should have buried a few, but you couldn't have asked nothing more from all the boys. From the back, everyone was absolutely outstanding. I said so, it's probably all the best games he's played. But, yeah, I couldn't fault the boys' efforts, and it's, it's an hard place to go for He's done Yeah, I've got to uh, admit, the fans are very vocal, aren't they? <laughs> yeah. Absolutely. Do you see any positives, though? Oh, yeah, absolutely. I just said, like, we played for that full 60, and when we did play our structure, they only had nothing that showed for the first two periods, and I think it was just the fact of we just fatigued at the end, and yeah, a few calls didn't go our way. I'm guessing a few didn't go their way, but that's hockey, and we move past it onto next week. Yeah, and, that, and that's one of the things about any sport, isn't it? Their decisions don't always go either way for you. Um, I don't think it was any one way or the other, but yeah. Um, do you think you shocked them with the first two periods? Uh, possibly not, because they knew what they were getting from last week. Obviously, I think last week, more of a shot, we would fall them up. Not that fifth one disallowed. So, from the off, we knew they were going to come back and skate, and they had a few extra bodies tonight. We were only four lines, and we had our three. So, yeah, I think mean, that's the line. It's, yeah, they're going to be that bit fresher, but can't fault the boys' effort at all tonight. Yeah, absolutely, and I think Gavin got it right when he said in the, in the locker room at the end, his little speech, it was absolutely brilliant. Um, Evan, an absolutely stunning game for Evan, well-deserved man of the match. Yeah, yeah. I mean, absolutely sticked up to Evan, he was, he was fantastic all the way through, and I think if it worked for him, then I don't know what the score could have been, like, yeah, he was outstanding tonight. I think over the four, out of the four, three periods, he got about 60 shots on him. So, I mean, that's an absolutely brilliant percentage. Yeah, like, that's a crazy, crazy amount of shots to take. I know after the first gal coming in, like, he just faced 20 shots, and it was like, wow, like, he's playing his absolute socks off here. And, as like I said, if it were for Evan today, then, yeah, it could be a cricket score. So, absolute stick top to him. Best game I've seen him play. Yeah, brilliant. I think everybody played for them, like we've heard and we've said, everybody put them in, everybody owned up, everybody was there, stood up, did what they needed to do. Um, I think it's a very positive performance. Hope you have a good journey home then, Ken, and uh, we'll see you at training. Yeah, I appreciate it, then. <laughs> 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 Nobody else in the big room. Well, boys, uh, Saturday's game. Really pleased with the performance. All right, real good battling performance. Uh, not the best result, but um, that's what we're here to work on, isn't it? Um, this weekend, we've got Telford at home. On home ice against them on an early face-off. Catch them cold. Get into them early. 
see if we can get some goals ahead. One thing we maybe didn't have as much of at the weekend was a little bit of offence. Um, but that's just the nature of the game that we were in. Um, tonight, we're going to do just a few uh, shooting just one goal. He's up. We've got four goalies on tonight, tonight I think. Four. Yeah. So I'll get plenty of shots on them. We'll do a couple of two on ones. But what I would like to do tonight is for lines one and two, which will be power play lines, um, just to run through some power play PK drills, just to give you a bit more at, uh, work on the zone entries and maybe actually start actually in the zone doing face offs and things and we'll go through some stuff like that. So you guys that aren't in a white or a blue, um, you'll be doing that PK for us and then occasionally just going on the power play as well. So, first two drills, um, we're going to start off, we're going to do this alternate sides at both ends. So we'll have players down here, players down here. Uh, we'll probably start off with the pucks in the corner. Players going to skate in, receive a pass, give it back. We're going to pivot, receive a pass, give it back. Get to the top of the circles, come back, one more pass, take a shot. As soon as he's done that pivot, we'll start from the other side and we'll just go alternate on both, yeah? Okay, so we'll do that. So second drill, we'll do that one where we're doing it from the corners and the sides, okay, so we're going to start off, you'll arc out, get a pass, go in, take a shot, you'll arc out, get a pass, go in, take a shot, guy from this corner, get a pass, take a shot, guy from that side, get a pass, take a shot, then reset. We'll just do those two drills real quick and move on to that. Go away. Well, good afternoon everybody and welcome to Hull Arena for this afternoon's Sharks versus Telford Tigers face-off. We've got a bit of a shortened warm-up period at the moment, then there'll be a five-minute gap and we will face off at 12.30. So, welcome. I'll just go through the sheet for the Sharks. Number one, Evan Byron Bates. Number two, Eden Cooper. Sharks are going with Taylor at centre, Hogarth on the left and Tidy on the right. And Martin and Sorensen in D. So there we go. We're lined up. We all know what we're doing. And the puck goes. So. Puck drops. Super. Off the bar. No! That under bar came back out. No way! Referee! <coughs> That's rubbish! Dear me! What an absolutely atrocious call. The goal judges said no. The lineswoman who was not really in the way said yes. Apologize. Comes out over the blue line. Second goal there. Second goal for Sharks, 159 remaining. Let's keep these heads up, boys. It's fucking one period, eh? Yeah. Wait, well, boys, really well. And it's a goal that didn't fucking, well two goals that's going to fucking count for it's uh, crossbar. Let's keep these chins up, eh? 
I can't believe you don't ask a goal. That's a goal, On their second goal, fair enough, it was fucking offside, it don't fucking matter. You can't let that fucking guy tail around and fucking get into a lane like that because he was wide open. The men's got to stay with him, get in his lane, get a stick on the fucking foot. You can't let him have an open shot like that. Well, sticks have got to be on the ice as well. In our D zone, our sticks are flying at our fucking shoulders. Fuck me. Hey, let's start moving our feet as well, boys. Come on. Hey, positive, positive one, though, boys. I know, but we've got to be better. We are playing. Think back to last fucking season, boys. It's been about 5 0 by now, so. Yeah, but we've got to move on and we've got to start sticking shit. When someone's gone shit, it's gone shit. We've got to wake the fuck up. Come on. Let's fucking go, yeah? Come on. Why is that fucking, that these so fucking swart and tear? You get it in, there was one point, I think he was on the power play. They had two D set. We had a white guy here, the puck came here, we played it across the ice. Look for that head man, just come back. You got three forwards coming up here. Put it on that blue line. Get a guy on that blue line. Get it moved up, tip it in. If you got time, take a look. Skate it in. There's plenty of time with, we're trying to do too much with the puck. In small areas, they get that puck up, headband the puck, get it in there, so bet they D10, because they won't like doing that all game, man. honestly. You get so many turnovers in their engine because their deer getting so fucking tired. Well, it's despite it's being 2 0 down, yeah, we've played some good fucking hockey out of this, so let's just keep working. See that work rate, right? fucking nice and hard, boys, eh? We had the better period. Stick together. We had the better period, period. period boys. Uh, keep back that first goal. What? I, I don't know how she fucking called it from there, because it's not a goal. You're it's, circles. It's, it's impossible for a, a puck to go on the inside of a crossbar. Oh, yeah, and then pop I was going to uh, I'm yeah, yeah, I was gonna, I was gonna go by a protractor to see, to show Tony that it's I'm impossible. The second goal was offside, but one. we know what we're yeah. dealing with here. We've just got to keep doing what we're doing. Everybody's playing out. It's a fast game. They're very, very, very good on the counter attack. Very good. But everybody's playing well. We're having the shots, we're having the opportunities. Scott ain't Scott ain't fucking nearly had one. Fucking brilliant play. You know, it's coming. This time last year when we were playing these guys, these are the being five, six nil up against us. Oh, tried to get through. Comes back to point. Mark because we're the point Humphrey shit. Howells picking that lovely kill. Oh, Hogarth's free. Hogarth is the fastest I've seen. Oh! Penalty shot! Penalty shot there. Oh, my lordy lordy. Hogarth all the way through. Taking away. And it's a penalty shot. Now, those of you who watch. Telford are complaining about, he threw his stick, he was beaten, threw his stick and blocked the puck. So that's not a save, that's another penalty shot. Even I know that, and I only got to page 59 of the rule book. So here we go again. Back out over the blue line. Hogarth's got to forget about that shot now. Get on with the game. Oh, there we go. Humphrey. There we go. Goal number two for your 
Tiger Sharks. I need to put that on. Bartholomew and Taylor again behind the net. Both of them going to have a seat, have a little bit of a rest. Oh, nearly. Telford's collapsing right in the middle. Cub Sam Hurst keeping an eye on that. Basically comes out. Oh. Little bit of error there. Very good boy. 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 Good Hey, Jack Boyd. Oh, yeah. hey, Sorry, Dom. Boys, that's what we won that period, 2-1. Let's go again, yeah? Let's win the next one, let's win the next one. I could, I had Dainty coming across, and you there. I thought even if Dainty ends up tipping it, it's just on the eyes. Add a fucking Boys, we're on that period 2 1, yeah? Let's take it to them now, yeah? We've got, what, 20 more minutes, boys, to leave everything out there, yeah? We've done 40, yeah? Let's keep them fucking going, we're doing really well. Stay out of that box and keep fucking hard on them, because their D's have not got a shitty clue what happens when we go out and we speed. Let's say, boys, you know what fucking Boyton's like? He's going to call everything that he fucking sees. Uh, just don't give him any excuse, and we'll get like it. Yeah, please. Hey, lads, fucking bro. Sorry about that, too, man. Obviously, I took a wound. Right, obviously, yeah. you can fucking last year, just try to get to the adventure fucking The only way you're going to get into it. Hey, that's a fucking dump in the corner and a hard clean it. That's all that is. Guys, listen, just fucking win the game. Yeah. Buckle. Woo! Okay. Boys, ultimately, this is our game without Playdom. Yo, listen up to CC. All day long, we are at, we're out playing him. All they are doing is relying on that break, that cross eyes to end up with a three on two with a trailer to score and it, it works for them that's what they play we are genuinely we're out playing them i think we're out we must be out shooting them. oh 100 yeah. percent all right so we, we are playing well we just it's just those chances take us chances that last goal was just a lucky bounce on there yeah like, that's all it was if that had took a deflection and bounce the way it did that wouldn't have fucking gone anywhere near like that you just got better down boys like watching as well like if the fall when you when you're pressing the d and they're going behind the net i think i said it to to jack don't follow them behind the net if you get the opportunity. Like, if they're struggling with the block and then the thing will dangle them fucking, and it's bouncing up and everything and they've got control of it, yeah, follow them in, force that play. But sometimes we're doing it, they're going behind the net, but we're following them around. That just takes you directly straight out of that play. If you get the chance and they're coming around the net, go in front of the net, try and make them stop, make them go on their back on their west hand. Make them play on the backhand if you have to. But as soon as you follow them around the net, that's you out the play straight away. So try and get back and just hang off a little bit. Make them make a decision where they're going to go, unless they have to stop. If they stop, that's when we set up five in their zone. So one thing I've noticed as well, boys, has been on that fucking D line, is when we have got the fucking hook in their zone, they are shitting their zone. When we're making them fucking crisp passes, everyone's moving about, they ain't got a fucking clue where they need to be. They ain't got a fucking clue. They're just trying to find the puck, eat it, and get the fucking thing out. That's all they're trying to do. Just keep fucking at it, boys. Keep back here, keep the shots going. We'll fucking go in. We'll fucking have it, boys. Let's go. Lads, we're trapping up. If they're skating back to the puck, that D man, he's got his back to you. Do the far check. If they've already got control of the puck and they're cracking out, then trap up. But that like F3, that middle guy, he's just got to push up the ice because quite a lot of the time of our lives, that F3 is stuck between the two demons and it's just leaving both the first far will angle them and then it'll just leave the centre lane pass straight away. Because we're up a bit, he's going to cut that middle out and then we'll have the three opportunities to push and shoot the puck. So that was fucking 
do, lads. Fucking good back to CC, fuck it, I'll wait for it. Oh, boys. Should have had three. Should have had three. Should have had three. Yeah, let's take that cup away. It was a bad pass. Didn't even go in. Goes well wide there by Griffin, comes all the way out. Humphreys is chasing that. Tried to get in front. Martin. Goal there on the power play. For a big man, he went down quite easily there, let's be honest. Denton. Puck. Stuck under his skates. Humphreys picks that up. Penalty's nearly finished. Howells tries to bring that back off the keeper. Telford back to full strength. No, back and goal! Humphreys with a backhander. The back of the net. There we go. 5 3. The one thing you can own, give her a key. Taylor. Taylor's gone in for a slash on the keeper. Well, there we go. That's it, folks. That's all she wrote. 5-3 to the Tigers in a, an interesting and feisty game. Today, guys, we proved that we can fucking skate with the best team in the fucking league. They should never have got that them fucking two goals. That's a fucking 3-3 game, all of. Right, we just skated for fucking night at 60 minutes with them. And I'm proud of every single one of you. Everybody dug it in. There was a few shitty bits on the fucking bench. That's just passion. It's going to happen no matter what. However, we all kept our heads. And we all fucking played well. And we all played like a team. It's a million times better than it was last year. You know what I mean? So it's a fucking privilege to play with all you guys this year. After that. Okay, so we're here now then, post-match with Scott. Um, how did you see that game from your perspective on that bench? It was really good from where we've come from last year. I mean, Telford obviously league champions. That they were beating most teams last year. I think they were undefeated this year. I think they won eight out of eight. And to give them a game here, especially, I say, what they did to us last year. I mean, they're a really good team. It just proves the shows the improvement of the guys and what we've recruited, what works in the summer, just to make things better. Yeah, the spirit of the game. How pleased are you with the spirit of the players today? Yeah, I mean, that's difficult for us to coach. You know, our, our players, I suppose, are their, their attitudes and things like that. And I thought they're really agile in together as a team. And I say, hopefully that's showing up on the ice as well. Definitely is. It's definitely performance change. What do you think is the biggest change from last season to this then, do you? Bit of self-confidence. There's all sorts of stuff. Self-confidence, bit of self-worth. You know, we know we've got guys that they know that they won't score 30 goals a season. So, do you know, we've given people roles. Do you know what to do? Do you know what's expected of people? And do you know, I think everybody's doing their little bit just to push the team on. There's, there's no eye in it, You know, we're just a, a gelled unit. And, you know, we're showing it every single game. We could have come into this game five, 
five out of five wins. Do you know we're not? Do you know that's how it is? Yeah. You know? I think there's definitely, definitely, and uh, I mentioned it on the um, live stream about the spirit of the team. Yeah. I think you guys should be proud of it. Thanks again, then, Welcome. Scott, for your Welcome. time. Welcome. And uh, we'll speak to you soon. Thank you. Appreciate it. Thank you. So, first door of business. We had a few guys in mind when we started the season. There's about four or five names with us for assistant captain. Um, we're going to get out tonight, so step up, TC. <laughs> all the guys from Sheffield have been racing champ since fucking turning up. Honestly, it's been fucking great to have you down. Um, well, sure, the is wrong. They, they will be stitched onto your uh, jerseys by Biggie, so just hand it back to the weather. Hand it back to Jay, she's more sensible. Well done, well done. Let's go. Well done, mate. Yeah. So, well done. upcoming weekend. Thanks, yeah. Upcoming weekend. Two fucking winnable games based on results and shit, yeah. How we've been playing. You said to some of you guys over there, I'm fairly disappointed we didn't get four out of five. We could have been five out of five. Yeah, we're not. But we're still fifth in the league, fucking miles better than last year. And we have got, I say, we've got a good run now of games that we can win. Alright, so let's get back to fucking winning ways. So, warm up. We'll just go up in the corners, opposite sides go. First one, we'll just scale out with a puck, throw it up, give it back. Bottom of the circle, take a shot. Second drill, again, opposite side, scale out, throw it up. One, two, down to the ball, to open up, keep it up. Yeah, straight in my fucking helmet. That's right, it was that kid from, it was kid from us, sorry. Cushion. Bad Harris, Joe, innit? It was cushioning. It, it came from there in the back. Good old day from Harris. Good old Kyle Quinn. Fuck me. Kyle Quinn. Yeah, it was Kyle Quinn. Fuck me. 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 Today it's going to require a bit of patience. Okay? Mm -hmm. No, they're a good team. They're alright, they can have a fuck around. Yeah, but last time they underestimated us, look what happened to them. Alright? We're going to have to face adversity. We fucking face adversity every single game. Who is against players? Who is against fucking referees making bullshit calls? Alright? That's it. Unfortunately, that's the bounce of a puck. That is shit we cannot fucking control. Alright? Left is a go. Left is a shit penalty. Give a go, give a shit penalty. Nothing we can do by way of now. Fucking arms about. Yeah, there's absolutely nothing we can do to change their calls, alright? So, sticking together. This is for fucking every player. Yeah? Every day this room needs to stick together. I know they he slashed me, so we're going on a fucking cross check gun. Yeah? I mean, we stick together as a fucking unit, yeah? We all stick to the game plan. Right? They play the same way every single year, every single time. They set it up in the corner and behind the net and then they look for a guy that's just coming straight through our box to hit him to then take the shot through. The D-man that is not in the corner and not engaging that, the player in the corner needs to cover the net and needs to have feet up ice to cover. Yeah, We can't be watching the puck from the corner. 
we need to have feet so we can see the whole of the ice because otherwise they will literally just play around us pass it to that guy that's it straight in the middle of the spot on his own so we need to have that head on a swivel if it's not there someone should be fucking shouting at you yeah so let's 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 yeah let's play that game we know what they're going to do we know what we can do okay now fellas come on guys through the centre slot all the fucking time and it's gonna you, you, you did you did call it but we can't we can't be doing that it's this the second guy so confusing when 
We've got to not follow him though. Feet. People are following me out of the net. Oh, the feet, boys. They said, the feet, boys. Two things. Number one, it's one all. One one game. Yeah? They might have had possession, but it's one one. That's fine. So, just a couple of things from me. Shut the fuck up on the bench being negative. Someone does something wrong, they've not fucking done it on purpose, have they? They've not done it because they fancied doing some shit. They've done it because they've tried something and it's not worked. So stop being negative. Yeah, otherwise no one's going to try to do anything. And then what's the point in playing? Yeah, the only way you're going to do something is by trying to do it. And if it fucks up, so be it. Shit happens. We're not playing in the NHL.